everyone and welcome back to another Terraria video. I'm the GamePro232 and I'm here to show you how to get Temple Traps. And uh, I've seen this in my, uh, uh, how people like find my uh, Temple Trap videos. And a lot of them, a lot of the uh, search questions are questions on how to get them. So I thought today that I would show you guys how to get them so uh, to to find the temple I have to find the temple I'm just te also gonna teach you how to find the temple in the simplest way possible you basically just dig holes straight down I like to call them elevators into the underworld and hopefully you find them So I think I'm going to go down right there. Right around here, maybe. Yeah, okay. It's a very long process. You may actually want to skip to the uh, la a later part in the video. Because this is a very long dig. I didn't realize how slow a pick saw was when I started digging this, so I apologize for that. So once you get to the underworld, sorry for that long thing, uh, you, you look up your little elevator, as you can see, no temple, so let's just, uh, I'll be right back. So that right there, that was not even a full second for you, for you guys, uh, but it was like 15 minutes for me. I finally found the temple after lots of digging, and uh... 
after just two full elevators, I decided, uh, you know what, why not just go straight to the middle? That's probably where it is. So, it's not always the same. Sometimes it's, it's completely random where the temple will spawn. So, don't take the fact that I found it in the exact middle. Literally, that that's the only way to find it. So, yeah. I'm going to be a little bit cheeky here. I, I'm not very... I'm going to cheat a little bit and uh, dig through the door. But, actually, no. I'm going to dig around it because I don't want to um, damage the... I don't want to flood the place. That's what I'm saying. Okay, so right here. First trap of the day. Spiky ball traps. These things are awesome for when you want to just get a bunch of... Um, money and stuff by doing nothing you can just stand above a bunch of spike ball traps and they'll kill things for you that's usually how I handle a, pump, a pumpkin moon or a frost moon but I also help a little bit too um, so just digging around now as you may also have noticed that I'm carrying wire cutters that is for cutting wires obviously in the temple so that you don't so that this doesn't happen to you right there I ran across and it hurt and it's really bad because dragon armor isn't the best defense armor it's only for fighting and uh, probably should have worn my beetle armor for this expedition but even it even the best of us can be can be bamboozled by little traps you also want to remove as many spiky, um, I think, what are, I don't know what they're called, actually. Wooden spikes. Yeah, they're wooden spikes. I'm going to cut the wires around here. These are the wire cutters. Just got one more to cut. There. And then once this is all disconnected, it doesn't do anything. Very convenient. So let's just delete all the useful things, and right there, that's a super dark trap. And above my head, more spiky ball traps. In the temple, you will find more spiky ball traps than anything, so just be aware of that if if you want anything uh, other than that, then tough. So, um, you can find all these traps easily just by using a uh, wire set of something and I'm just gonna end the video right here so I don't waste your time now you know what to do dig it with pigsaw if you enjoyed this video please be sure to like hit that like button and if you really enjoyed it please be sure to subscribe this has been the game pro 232 and I'm out see you later folks